Nice, nice to meet you. you. Congratulations Great on winning, by the way. Great to meet you. Yeah, nice That's to meet awesome. you, man. Yeah, for sure, That's man. That's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> so excited. Yeah. Yeah. How are y'all doing? Yeah. Patrick, nice to meet all y'all. Yeah, for sure. Jordan, nice to meet you. Store. Okay, nice Jordan, to meet y'all. I think yeah. we're going to start off by throwing the football as long as you can stand it. Nah, that sounds good to me. That's what I do best. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The highlight of the day for me was throwing the football in the front yard. I mean, that's something that you don't always get to do, especially with an active NFL player, so that was by far the best. Who's up? Anybody ready? Well, it was great to have my friends and family there to uh, share the experience with me. For them to be able to be there and support me and help me through it and then make me comfortable with my homes and just having them there. There it is. Oh, good catch! The highlight of the day was probably my, my man right here, his hand. So I, I was throwing the football and little man was, was catching everything. So that was definitely the highlight of the day. I always think that uh, athletes have like this high personality and they just, you know, they don't really relate to ordinary people like us, but he's completely down to earth, just like you or me or anybody. It was awesome. I just want to ask you about the uh, NASCAR race. Yes. The jorts and the cutoff. The full story. All right, so <laughs> calling him out. A Anthony, no, no, no. so Anthony Sherman, our fullback, he had went. They went to the race last year, and I didn't get to go. And it was with him and Garrett Dieter, and a lot of guys went. I asked Sherman, "Shall I wear the jorts?" And he was like, "Yeah, if you wear the jorts, you're gonna be good. Like I won't say anything. I'm like, All right, I'll wear them." It blew up over social media. I get asked about it literally every single interview, every single thing I do now. Well, that was definitely a surprise because I know I'd never be able to afford it. <laughs> Being able to get Patrick in on it and go through the box card by card, it was it was awesome. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, Doug Baldwin. Yeah, being with JP here uh, was an awesome experience. I mean, him and his family and his friends were all very cool people. Uh, they were, they kept it where I was a little nervous at first, but they kind of made it where we kind of got along really well, and so it was an awesome experience to be out here with them. Nice to meet you. Well, collecting cards definitely led me to being able to hang out with Mahomes. Um, I really never thought it was possible. I, I just, you know, I didn't think it could lead anything like this. But so to get the opportunity from Panini to hang out with Mahomes was amazing. Straight through. Hey. Getting your own trading card, is, I mean, when you're growing up, you collect them. You look at those cards of your favorite players, and so to see my name and my picture on those trading cards is something that's it's really surreal and something that I, I will never forget. Panini uh, Player of the Day program, along with the Father's Day program, and other great programs like that encourage buyers to buy a whole box of cards or even packs of cards and win additional free packs where they can get their superstars and even memorabilia and autograph cards. You want me in the middle? Oh. Being part of the Panini family has been awesome the, the whole entire time. I mean, just, it really is a family. Uh, Y'all have really accepted me in and it's been a smooth transition as I've kind of began my career and I'm excited for everything going forward.